Hello and welcome to this ZenWorks Service Desk 24.2 upgrade demonstration. Today we're going to look at what features are in this release, the ZSD version upgrade method and tasks, and then we'll have a demonstration for you along with documentation and references. Some of the feature enhancements in ZSD 24.2 is the in-place upgrade through the online update channel, which we'll show in this demonstration. We have a separate video on the features, which includes CMDB modernization for the manufacturer's page, the update for the quarterly security patch updates, bulk edit updates for requests that are in a group, some SAML SSO documentation improvements if you're connecting to Shibboleth or other SAML connections. In a request details, there's a group link. Also revealing all privileges with hover over tooltips. Feel free to view the new features and enhancements in version 24.2 video for details on those particular improvements and enhancements. As far as the upgrade methods, this one is an in-place upgrade, which is performed through the online update tile in the Appliance Administration console. And it's considered a minor update. It does have schema changes in this particular one. Some of the upgrade tasks for version 24.2 is it must be at version 24.1 before upgrading to this latest version. Be sure to back up the appliance in the database. Log into the ZSD Appliance Administration Console, which is port 9443. Select the online update tile. This will display the 24.2 service desk release and displays the security updates. Accept the prompt, install and reboot. Again, log into the ZSD Administration Console after it's rebooted. The version should be 24.2. Once you select the Technician Portal tile, you'll see the database has been successfully upgraded prompt, which you can see to the right here. Once you hit Close, technicians and customers can log in. Once the upgrade is completed, be sure to verify all systems communicating to this system and document in your corporate system records. Here's a visual on the upgrade from 24.1 to 24.2. Currently, it resides in the 24.x channel. It's version 24.1. You get security fixes, you get the service release package that are all in the online update. When 24.2 comes out, you'll see a red exclamation point, and this is where you'll install it. You'll be prompted for a wizard to accept the instructions and reboot requirements. This is where you'll download and install these particular fixes and update. At which time, the upgrade process will complete, installed, and it'll reboot. Once it reboots, you'll still be connected to the 24.x channel for any further releases or security patches, and the version will be at 24.2. Be sure to reference the ZSD 24.2 Upgrade Cookbook for any other questions and refer to your documentation for your environment. Let's do an upgrade demonstration. We'll go ahead and log in as SD Admin or root, and you can see that we have an online update available to us. Let's see, we're at version 24.1 at this time. We go ahead and select the online update, and we may or may not have some security updates depending on when we last patched it, but you can see we have ZenWorks Service Desk 24.2 available as the features, and that will require a restart. So we'll go ahead and update now. We'll be prompted about the reboot. We'll select OK. This will install any security patches that might be there as well as the service desk latest release. Being a minor update, we don't have to run a prereq like we do when we do a migration from one appliance to the other, going from major updates. So we're gonna wait for this to progress and then we'll reboot and we should see that we're at 24.2.
Yeah, I'll refresh the patches available, and there are no more needed patches. We can see the install patches if we wanted to view those. We'll go ahead and close here, and you'll see that we have a reboot needed in the upper right-hand corner. So we'll go ahead and do a reboot needed. Select that, and it'll do a restart, which will prompt you that it's rebooting the system. Okay, let's go on over to our administration appliance console. Nine four four three. Log back in. Wait for it to sit for a second for it to connect and get all the services running. Let's go ahead and log back in. Gonna log in as SD admin again. We will see that we're at 24.2 here. If we go to our um, technician portal, very first login on the technician portal after the update. It does the database schema and updates, and we can see it has been successfully upgraded to 24.2. We can close that, and from now on, we can log in as technician or customer. So if you're logged in as, let's go super, super space. We can go to, Our setup and setup licenses. We can see we're at 24.2. Now we can implement the features in ZSD 24.2. So the ZST system login information is here. There's a few TIDs that you can use should you need to troubleshoot anything. This covers service logs as well as setting them into debug. Here's some documentation and video references for version 24.2. Whether you're doing system planning, administration guide, the new end user portal, which is a customer or the user guide, which is a technician. There's documentation on the Zenworks integration with service desk and the Zenworks store, along with the popular ZST system customization cookbook. A few community references are here as well regarding lookbooks and documentation around the version. This concludes our video for the OpenText Zenworks Service Desk upgrade to version 24.2.